exciting times here in Lahore, given what happened in match 16, but this is now match 17. And the Kalundas, they're hosting Islamabad United, who've won this title on uh, two occasions in the brief history of the HBL PSL. Coin toss with Bazid Khan just a little while earlier, and the Kalundas got lucky with it. Sanitising, thank you, young men. The umpires uh, all cleansed with the hands. The players are ready. Get into the huddle of the home side. Nice little rev up before they take the field. Shine of Reedy has been left out. He had some issues with his left thumb. He had a, he's got a hairline fracture, so I'm not sure how long he's going to be out. Shinwari comes in in his place. And uh, spinning the toss and looking to ball first. But I know sides love to know what to chase down. They love to see what the total is and see what they can do, having had a look at the pitch and how it's playing. It's a little while ago, but when you look at Munro, as you mentioned, to both these players with a lot of experience. Radio, here we go. Needed that arm ball and little angle and row downtown. Here's our first maximum six HBL Golutlo. Twenty thousand more in the bank for the charity. What a hit! It was just there, just given a little bit of room, moved away from the stumps. That was a big hit. Another one. That's gone out of the hair. Wonderful strike. With Samit Patel having another one. Particularly if Munro got on strike. And that is that. Sweet. Well, enough pressure was put on to Lahore Kalandas. Fees himself out there. Oh, that's a lovely little clip. Dealing in boundaries in this over. This is an over that targeted captains in the big bash. You've got Ben Dunk, who's been around a long time keeping, and Muhammad Hafiz himself. With all that experience. Oh, I've been boshed everywhere in this over. 22 from the third. It's 30 without loss now. In the HBL PSL in Pakistan. Can't set a feel for that. Oh, it's almost gone the whole way. Had enough of it, wanted to just over, go over that square leg boundary. Top edge. Gone right over the keeper's head, just one bounce. Stellar night last night, 4 for 30 off his four overs. Well, that's inexplicable. There is no way that the ball should be able to go past the left hand of the extra cover and the right hand of the mid-off. Munro has just lent on that. Look at that gap, it's like the Grand Canyon and they both missed it. Hopeless. <laughs> well, that's a delightful stroke. Shows that you don't necessarily have to try and bludgeon the ball. The play began as being like an indoor school. And anybody that's ever bowled in one of those knows that if you get the ball on a length, all you have to do as a batsman is get the hands through it and it will disappear. Catch! Catch! Oh. Luke Ronke just looking to open up that offside. The man at extra cover was in, tight saving one off the 30-yard uh, the circle. Probably lost a fingernail or two. And again, and this one even better. Poetry, isn't it? It's just so easy. Doesn't have to leave his crease, just gets a good stride in to transfer the weight. It's incredibly uncomfortable. And this one's just racing away for four. Bowled a bad ball, really, yeah. None for eight they were after two overs, and this happened. Samit Patel going for 22. This six in particular was massive over mid-wicket. 
Look how pure some of this striking was. Not trying to overhit the ball too much, probably aided there by some inauspicious fielding. Being able to tuck batsmen up on the hip and not give them anything. And then he goes and gives him a short wide one. Thanks a lot, Dilbert. Three down. Ended up with 205. Needs to get that rate up above tens from here. Oh, well, that'll do it. That'll help it out. Yeah, and this is just a little drop kick over the fence. Doesn't try to hit it too hard. And that's been a feature of this opening partnership. They haven't really tried to force the ball. Oh dear, no. Absolute howler in the deep. His uh, second 50 in the PSL. Of the season, they've had a, in game two, they had a partnership of 92. Lots of play yesterday. It looks as though we might only get half the ground full, but as the news started to circulate. Here we go. He's launched this. Moves on to 46. Again, it's easy as you like. The line just straying on the leg stump and just helped it on its way. This pitch is a belter, folks. Finally, not out. Here we go. First one, top edge. Gone. Genius move. Try and cramp up the batsman. Ooh, that one he gave a bit of air. First time, it's gone above the batsman's eye line. And guess what? He gets slammed down the ground for four. Talking about just slight bit of flight. Well, you don't do that in T20 cricket, especially against a player like Monroe, who's absolutely slammed it back. There's no spin, There's, the ball is just racing onto the middle of the bat. You've got to drive it into the pitch a bit more. Talk about driving, talk about cutting. He's cut that just over point and it's gone to the fence. Put the ball up into uh, the stands where a couple of lovely ladies are enjoying a cup of tea. This is Ingram of the two Collins on strike. Oh, not a great start. Dilbar. And all of a sudden, we've got another boundary. Back to back because uh, Fazan's got to finish the over here. And with the fine leg up in the circle, you're asking trouble. That's gone for four. It's getting greasier, a little bit of rain around. This in the air, and that might go all the way. Might go all the way. Just landed inside. Have to be full, Shinwari. That length will disappear. And it has disappeared. He came up to me and asked me what else I, I can get improve on. So I was saying, just trying to tell him to just keep it simple and pull there. And you'll get the wicket. And you've got it. Look like a nick. Look like a big nick. Yes, you got confirmation from the crowd. A single and a wicket, that's all. But now Asifali is out in the centre for United. He's going block hole, but he's missing it. And that's what happens. Move further. Edge and four. Asif is in a mood. You have to take a short hair. 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 ये रहा अंगूठा शाहीन तो मैंने इसलिए ये सोचा कि मैं फुल पेस से भी बॉलिंग नहीं कर सकता और ये बेहतर होगा कि मैं बैट जाऊं। Right on. Two more deliveries, two last deliveries of the game. Got it. Has he got all of it? Has he? Oh, you know it. The previous two to go past 50 HBL maximums. Asif's joined them. Well, he's an ideal player to have in the side of betting number five or six. Last few overs is very, very dangerous. Well ball. Got it in the hole. Oh, 
Monroe who batted through. And here's the first ball of the chase. And we just see Dale Stain out there. Reasonable campaign so far. Well, this one's got straight up. What a start this is. And held. Took his time, settled himself under the ball. He wanted to go big. Watch that. Watch that. Reverse cup. Play a role tonight. Again, the HBL buggy. Oh, a little bit of width and the fees oblige us. Again, I would like to salute the people in Siachen. We always salute Michael our great Lee. heroes in Siachen. Right now, Lahore Kalandars have to summit 199. Trying to pull this across the line, lame top edge. Let's try to help it around the corner. This innings is quickly in disarray. Young Akif, just a touch short, got a little big on Muhammad Afiz, wanted to play a little bit more squarer, and had no control over that shot. So, those kind of Amka? Farooq Shah. Deep point, deep third man. He's timed this beautifully as well. On the leg side, will it run for four? Sam Buck goes up and over. The Buck would take a risk. And it paid dividends for him this time. The first ball of Young Active Jarvid. Jarvid's over. What he played in another lifetime ago, it feels. Cut away, that'll be back to back boundaries. He's going to flay you through cover. Yeah, well, that's better from Salman. Wonderful last night. And Dunk goes back. You must be seeing it like a watermelon at the moment. Getting a fair hammering, and so is the ball. And so is young Aki. He's had so much confidence, and understandably, But failed to put away the uh, the full toss. We're going to go upstairs. Have you seen a soft signal? Soft signal's not out. Oh, is that Freedy? And, uh, have a decision to make. What I saw from here looked like it was a bump ball to me. Front down, please. Front down. Okay, ball skilly. Yeah, quite right too. Didn't think my eyes were deceiving me. The feet has gone up above 12. And uh, it was mid-wicket that he was looking for. And it flashes away to the boundary. Straight down the ground, there's no stopping that. And numbers to come in. Fans have come in numbers here to Gaddafi to see more of this entertainment. Need boundaries. Oh, is there a nick? There is. Ben Dunk tucks the bat under his arm and he's off. Shadab Khan is off as well. And that's a huge, huge breakthrough. Massive moment, this. Yeah, it's the other one. Lovely little Google. The wrong end. Good keeping. And it's becoming uh, a tough task. Okay, but yeah. it's gone. He's found the man at backward point who clings on after his uh, clangor when the ball was on the ground in the previous over. 
and Zappa has his first wicket in the PSL. And he's back for the dugout now. And Zappa. And a little bit of flight. Up above 13 and a half. Here's the end of Salman okay. Park. Come on. Create a bit of width that wasn't there. And he picks out Talat and uh, yeah, his captain's delighted. Just the seven fours in the innings, no maximums yet. Oh, and that's nicked and gone flying. Fine of the man at slip. Then piled on plenty thereafter, 140. Oh, doesn't time that at all. Wanted to go over extra, but gets the boundary. Impressive last night. I think the contrast for me between these two innings tonight has been the way. And Suffer Gore also is getting the ball to spin off no the screen. No yes! Another little chip yes! and another wicket. Just trying to chip this and bunk this down the ground and put it too high. It's just sort of chipped it down the ground. It's almost like that catch a crow hitting it into the crowd. Is he trying to hit that straight? Well, that's not straight at all. That's 10 metres, 20 metres over the line. 20,000 to a charity. Go Lutlo and Fezan's done exactly that. No chip, no shimmy down the wicket, just slog it out of the ground. Think that the the team will going to win this PSL, but today they're missing straight ones. Fezan's missed that, and Zafar goes knocked him over. Can't see too much difference. Oh, well, that one again. We talk about momentum so often. Really, can't be serious about that one. I mean, good night, but let's not appeal for one missing leg by two stumps. PRS <laughs> time. No problem with the front foot. They've lost their review now. <laughs> what a strike this is. Gun barrel strike. There's a big appeal. No review needed. That's out. And now clinical performance with the ball. And happy that uh, our ball has bowled really well after being thrashed in the last uh, three games. Nothing to be gained. Particularly when you've got Yorkers like that. Giving it some Humpty and it's gone all the way. HBL six counter. Shinwari with a kaboo. Oh. Just having a bit of fun here at the end of match 17 because uh, Lahora well and truly out of this one. In the air, that could be all over. That could be it. Luke Ronke coming under it, should not drop that, he did drop that. In the night sky, these swirlers, and the breeze, got to say too, just got up a little bit more. Circle, circle me, boom, and it pops out, unlucky Luke Ronke. Defending. In the air, and that's gone all the way. I think he's out of here, that's massive. Yeah, young man, he's just bowled length again. Yeah, just shows again the timing. Not trying to bash it too hard. And there's Dilbar. A nice little chip for 83 metres. Oh, beautifully hit. Could be out, could be out. Oh, Dale Stain was the man. Tried his bit best to bring it back. I think he's gone for six. Yeah, he's palmed it over. You can see what he's tried to do. He just wanted to uh, get the old palm flick. But uh, was travelling quick enough. This straight up, a lot of wide open spaces. As taken, that is a fairy. But it is in fact the biggest 
margin of victory in PSL history.